Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome everybody guys, let's uh, take a look again on the euro currency. So it, indeed market has shown the downward action yesterday, but this action was a bit stronger than we expected because uh, initially we thought that that should be some kind of the ABCD action to complete and form right arm of this passion. So we have suggested this could be the hand shoulders. Sometimes it happens that the shoulders are not equal but it, this is not really very uh, often happens. At the same time, we should not forget that actually we have the evening star passion on the weekly chart. As we said in the weekly report, that will be uh, the, the, the major background for trading. And uh, from the perspective of this passion, nothing wrong has happened. Because market indeed has shown minor pullback inside of the body of this passion, and now is standing lower. So this is the normal classical price behavior with the morning stars, engulfings, so this is railroad tracks of the, by the Judd Napoli. This happens very often. Minor retracement happens inside of the body of the passion and then major action expansion starts. At this point, chances on the upward continuation and completion of some kind of the ABCD passion right now significantly lower than it, they were yesterday, but from the theoretical point of view they has, has not been have not been uh, totally erased so theoretically it is possible because market still stands above these lows so in fact we could imagine that this could be some kind of the ABC action but the things what I do not like and why I think that it's uh, not very probable just because of the, of the multiple accelerations to the downside guys so take a look at this action drop the reversal candle by the way flat action collapse again, very significant sell-off, almost tail, close, tail, tail closing, flat action. Collapse again, there's minor continuation, retracement, and again fast acceleration with the tail closing back to the lows. So that's very difficult to involve an idea of the possible deeper upward action here. Besides on the forward FM chart that we, uh, of the dollar index that we use, uh, recently very often as a cross-market analysis since, uh, since it provides uh, some clarity, um, it's better pictures. So take a look. That was, was our suggestion yesterday that market should chose our prediction. But the scale of this action, so it's re really very fast. It's not just some kind of the pullback here of this leg. So it's rather deep action. Almost erased this downward action and coming close and to, to the neckline and that could could happen that indeed we have uh, the sh small right arm of this passion market really could show the upward breakout so this is possible on the hourly chart you can see even stronger action to the upside approximately the same story we have on the on the euro currency so if we take a look at the follow time frame chart market has completed initially we thought this will be a b equals city op somewhere at 1240 uh, slightly lower 12.15 probably, uh, but market has dropped right to the XOP. It stands below weekly pivot point, below monthly pivot support one. Um, theoretically, we have, as I said, got this triple to buy passion here, but personally, in the current circumstances with this drop, I don't want to take the long position in such environment. Uh, today we do not have some significant uh, statistics. We have the inflation uh, in the United Kingdom and the, in Europe, CPI indicators, and ye law, uh, uh, ye in the evening we will have in the United States open session um, real estate statistics uh, on the United States market. So it's not really very strong statistics that could really significantly change the overall situation. On the hourly chart, we have a big drop here. Uh, so I think that we could keep an eye on two possible scenarios. 
First of all, we could keep an eye on the possible upper retracement somewhere to the 1240 area. Uh, maybe market will form even double repo buying here. So you can see this drop close above the 3x3 three three close below. So market will form close above. This could be double repo buy and this possible retracement. So I do not know whether you will trade the double repo or not, but uh, we could consider possible taking the short position depending on how market will behave. So this will be gradual and smooth upward reduction, some kind of the ABCD patient maybe will be formed. In this case, in around 1240, this could be a chance to go short. Uh, only if market will show very strong upside rally, something of that sort. If it will be very fast and upward reduction back to the stop, it could be kind of double bottom. And market indeed could complete the target with our first scenario, complete the top of the right arm on the hand shoulders. But if it will be very gradual scenario, some A, B, C, D, very slow action, right right now to the 1240, well, probably will be a chance to go short. Second moment, if market will start dropping lower. So coming close to this bottom and taking out of these lows will com 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 confirm that we're uh, going lower. And uh, in this case, we will keep an eye on the OP target. OP stands at 1060. So maybe it's some some kind of the preparation to the Fed meeting, something of that sort. Because recent statistics uh, was not disappointed. It's retail sales, uh, non-farm payrolls release, so they were all, both were possible, uh, p positive. Um, and maybe market is preparing to the Fed statement. As they start start to suspect that Fed will not support idea of the dovish cycle, so they will cut rate, but not more and market starts the preparation to that. So OP stands at 1060. So that's our suggestion. So today we are watching for reaction in this area. Gradual upward bounce in kind of the ABCD will be the chance to go short because it will confirm that this is not the reversal. This is not the, some kind of the large ABCD pattern, but this is just pullback of this trap. Or breaking below the XOP coming back to these lows also supports an idea of the possible downward continuation. Finally, guys, I would like to show you the Great British Pound. I could say only pound, sweet pound. So uh, it's coming to our XOP target that we have specified in our vehicle report in 2340. Yes, it was grubber, very nice action. So in, in recent few months, I like to trade uh, cable because this has clear direction to the downside. And uh, recently, it's very easy to investigate to to identify the points for taking the position. So cable behaves very uh, very accurately. So it's very good currency for trading right now. So let's see what we'll get on the euro today. It will be interesting.